Hello. And uh, welcome. Uh, why is this so bad? Oh gosh. Um. Oh. Um. There we go. <laughs> that was honestly really big. Um. Welcome to. Top 30 facts about bunnies. Each day, we will be doing 10 facts. So, let's start on our 10 facts right now. Um, so, of course, you know, I have a bunny. Uh, so, I'm... Get your bunny, it's your toy! Yeah. Hmm. Mm, yeah. So, as you know, I have a bunny, and um, for my birthday, I got this new rug for my mom, and um, he's been chewing the heck out of it. Look, the Enderman. The Enderman spot. I think he is just afraid of Enderman. Why didn't he chew the creeper? The creepers are not friendly. Not friendly. I don't know. Um, but we're gonna go check out my bunny and say hi to him, and then I'm gonna get him a chew toy. I know you might think that bunnies just like to lounge. You're right. That's fact number two. So let's get over here and head to see my bunny and tell him I'm getting a chew toy. So, uh, during the summertime. Oh, delicious in this. Um, hi, babies. Uh, yeah, I'm getting you a toy toy uh, in June, June 22nd. June 22nd. Yeah. Right. Maybe. <laughs> Don't you dare start chewing that. I like, saw what you were going to do. Those ears just popped up. Your little ears popped up. Okay. Effect number two is... Bunnies like to lounge, but Basket isn't lounging right now, but why don't you pet this? Let's see what happens when I pet Basket. Yeah, I need to suck him. With my toe, toe, can you please balance? My toe is balancing, but it's very wiggly. See, when you pet the bunny, of course, right now it is summertime, and he does not want to be petted. It is so hot, so hot with this fur coat. Um, but he occasionally will lounge. See, he's lounging. That's feet position. That feet, that foot position, and also that face. That that face. That that's a face. Oh, I don't don't want to use my book. Okay, it is summertime, so I understand you, buddy. Fact number three. Fact number three is any cold surface, like apparently the bathroom is cold, which my toes are like freezing right now. Uh, yeah. Um, any cold surface, like if you think like your bathroom tiles are cold, cold um i would probably suggest if you want to get a bunny you would probably start to put the bunny on this surface the surface that is cold in the summertime like you if you're getting used to having a pet bunny or like you, you need help uh getting a pet bunny and you don't know like what will make it happy in the summertime or what you need to do to help it in the summertime. Uh, put it on cold tiles such as the bathroom and other things. Bathrooms and if they include rugs, remember that I what I said in that one. Uh, get your bunny a chew toy. They will chew rugs. Like I showed you in the beginning of the episode, my tune up birthday rug. It's very helpful. I am going to check 
to my viewers real quick. Actually, I can't. It, it won't let me because I'm just going to end the video if I, I uh, get off YouTube. Basket, I see you. Uh, so yeah, and if you're not really used to having a pet as a bunny, like if you're, you had another pet that had died, and you want a bunny, where you can start is some hot dirt. No, no, oh, not hot. Nah, no, 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 not hot. Not hot. Very cold time. So if you have a very cold time, please, like the bathroom or your room, start with putting the bunny in there in the summertime. And then later on, you can put the bunny some like, you can let the bunny roam around. Just put a cage wherever um, those cold tiles are, and the bunny will be free to go. Is this fact three? Yeah, it's fact three. Okay, fact four. <clears throat> I can't see things very good. I am colorblind. Uh, I'm putting my fingers on the camera. Um, oh. Bunnies are really loving. Uh, yeah. So if you have a thing or something, read that to your bunny. Because they love to be read to. But. Just make sure you don't put the book too close. You just want to put it this close to the bunny so that he doesn't get upset and like <laughs> tries to chew. That is fact four. Fact five. Um, we have five more facts until fact ten. Fact five. Sure, just like you, humans, you need air to survive. So, I'll take them outside. If your neighbors have a big old mean dog like my neighbors, um, please take them in the backyard or your bunny in the backyard. Because the strangest thing will happen like this: stare at each other, and your bunny will not move, and the dog will not move, and the strangest thing will happen: they will not attack each other. They'll just sit there and stare at each other. Like, so weird. Um, yeah, it's fact five. Uh, fact five is that. And then fact six. Let's see. That. You are gonna be like blown away. If you need a friend for a bunny, also please do not get a boy bunny if you already have a boy bunny, because they will argue and they might try and kill each other. But so, we're not gonna talk about that. Um, if you have a dog and you want a bunny, feel free. Feel free. Can you believe it? They. So, you rub a washcloth on the dog, and then give it 
the bunny to smell, to get used to the smell. And then you can also do, you can also rub the washcloth on the bunny and then make sure the dog can smell that and will be used to that. I think that, yeah, that's the same with cats too. Like if you want a cat, and you, but you want a bunny, you can both, you have them both. Like you just rub the washcloth on the cat or the bunny and then you go to the cat or the bunny. It's so easy. Um, yeah. Several fact six. Yeah. Back seven. <sighs> Uh, fact seven is, what is fact seven? Why is fact seven? Fact seven. Mm. So, about food with bunnies, this might be a little hard for you. So, if you're just getting used to your bunny, you are going to need food and water, just like us humans need to survive. Then bunnies, and then cats, and then dogs. It's the same. They need food, but they all have different foods that they like. So I'm gonna show you what um, me and my my family uh, get for my bunny. Pellets. And if your rabbit is not an adult rabbit like mine, uh, you would get uh, child rabbit food. But I get adult rabbit food because um. Uh, they're just like bigger for my bunny and also bunnies can live to about about and he is yeah four he's four so he's technically an adult when you you are one as a baby you are a child you are a child plaything just like just like Woody says in the, like Toy Story, you remember? And they also need water. Um, once your bunny get used get used to this, um, when he you think he is drinking it, this thing, this green thing, will go down, down, and when it's to the bottom. That means he's drinking all of it, and he's just uh, thirty milligrams, twenty milligrams. No, 200 milligrams to the bottom. 200 milligrams. Yeah. Uh, what were we on fact seven? Yeah. Uh, fact eight. We are going also fact eight. Um... to draw your bunny on a piece of paper with crayons or anything, uh, I would suggest putting your bunny in a cage. If your bunny is a baby bunny, it will hop around a lot. A lot. And if you follow um, bun, 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 skit, bun, 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 on Instagram, he jumps so much. And he's afraid of the robot bunny. Oh my god. I can see myself in the TV. This is too much. I wonder if it's really good. Oh gosh. Um, back nine? Yeah, back nine. Now that we're on. Let's see, what can be fact nine? Oh! So you can teach your bunny sit and to stay and roll over and lay down. Um, I taught my bunny that and he is perfect. And I, you can teach your bunny how to run uh, too. It's so easy. Um, yeah. Bunny is so fun. And finally, fact 10. 
bag. Pam is such a cute one. As much as bunnies could be really, really, really a pain, they love to be around family. And there's that basket making a ruckus. <laughs> See, if you do not leave them alone, if you leave them alone for about, let's say, one second, they will go crazy. They love family and friends. So, if you always have a bunny, and you always want to have them, never give up, because they love them. Bye. We'll see you again on the next day. Uh, then, so we already got 10, so tomorrow we'll do 10. And as soon as we get to 30, um, facts, we will be rocking. Yeah. Oops, I need to do that.